Hey everybody, Christopher out here. Welcome back to Tomb Raider. We have to continue on our little path here to find all of these things that are scattered about. And then we're going to go find out what the hell's happening in this place. Our ultimate goal is, is to get over here. But we are going to, on our way, grab a few things. So let's start here. Grim, he seems pretty self-sufficient. I don't think we really need to worry about him that much. That being said, I don't want to leave him for too long. Because, who knows? I wouldn't want him to be in a situation where he feels like we've just neglected him. Now, how am I going to get down there exactly? That's the question. Can I jump over? Oh, yes, absolutely. Jumping barbed wire like it's nobody's business. I like it. Hear another pig. Okay, now there is another thing close by. So let's grab this as well. Just a little bit lower. You guys have given me a lot of really great advice too on the different upgrades that I can focus on. And so I'll try to uh, implement some of that as much as I can here. Duck and roll! Oh, that didn't work. Oh, is it? Oh, damn it. Well, that didn't work out. Way I planned. There we go. My patience has been rewarded. At long last, I have my lieutenants, my enforcers of the way. The storms brought me exactly the men I need to begin building the Solari Brotherhood. Strong of body, weak of will. They were broken in the storms, weakened and vulnerable. And I raise them up again. Now they serve me. And through me, her. The Sun Queen. She is showing me the way. She has always shown me the way. I cannot deny what I have seen. And soon, neither will they. She is everywhere on this island. But the Solari Brotherhood must grow. We will recruit as many as we can. I will draft laws, create a code for them to live by. And they will build for the Sun Queen while I search for the key. Okay, we're back. We had a that was we had a weird little crash there, but basically what Matthias is saying is he's becoming consumed with the Sun Queen and he's trying to grow his brotherhood aka his his cult and he's doing a pretty good job of it actually all right now we need to find another way back up there there's not really a good way to get to that side Aside from using the ropes. I can only imagine that this water is slightly less than sanitary. Cross here. Oh, Lord. Oh. 
Here we go. I have a feeling that we are going to be double crossed by somebody. I think that there's going to be somebody coming out of the woodwork that we thought we could trust, but it turns out that no, they can't be trusted. I don't know if that's going to end up being correct, but I guess when you're dealing with places like Yamatai, pretty much anything can happen. How can I work my way down there exactly? Looks like I should be able to shoot my way through. There we go. 13 of 15. Now, is there any more? There's one over here. But I don't see the 15th. Unless I'm missing it somehow. So we got the map, so they should all show. Really strange. Alright, well, we'll head here. Was it inside the cave? Oh, that is super hidden. Okay, so let's take another quick look here because we're missing one of them. Just one. And did we miss a tomb? There's two showing, but it says we've only raided one. Let's check out this one. Or is it the one that we're currently in? Yes, it is. Well, let's keep going then. Could remember if we've been in here or not. This is not a good scene. We're not going to be able to keep this torch going. Oh. So I have to give a shout out to uh, to somebody named... I hope I pronounce it correctly, but it's for Chris Sakes, I think. That's how you say it. And he's keeping a, uh, a kill counter in the comments. And we've reached, I think, uh, a couple episodes ago, it was... 150 kills which is like you know it's a little much for somebody that was tormented or not tormented but uh, kind of beating herself up for killing a deer in the first place is now on a somewhat murderous rampage it's kind of interesting The Chamber of Judgment. The Solari have completely taken over the old places of this island. Alright, let's see. From a gear perspective, we can upgrade quite a bit. Let's see. You do increase damage, faster cycling rate. Padded front grip reduces. I don't care about the kick. Let's go extra damage. And longer range works for me. We can go on the rifle, which I definitely need to use more. So that 
is fully upgraded now. Now we're almost out of parts, but... That'll work. Now what are we exploding this time? Okay, we've got a rock wall to climb. Let's see how this impacts anything. It's not really... Ah! Okay, we're going to probably need to weight this down then with these canisters. And we've got another one up here. Oh! Raiding these tombs is probably one of the most enjoyable aspects. Oh! Okay, now, can we actually... Hmm. Those shelves look weak. A bit more weight to bring them down. Oh, interesting. Okay. We have to use these to actually... I see, that's actually kind of smart. Tomb builders. There we go. And then we'll have to use them to hold this down. There's one. There's two. That should work. Oh! It doesn't! Okay, so... Interesting. Oh, we need the fourth one, that's why. How am I going to get it up there, though? Oh, you know what? I bet we can swing this over and break it this way. Yeah! Re resourcefulness. I'm a croft. I make things happen. Oh, really? Well, now what? Hmm. Those shells look weak. A bit more weight ought to bring them down. Are there more shells that I'm not seeing? This is really bizarre. Unless maybe there's something... Did 
I need to bring in here. Because the tomb did split at one point. bring something all this way. Yeah, see, now we're leaving. That's really bizarre. Here then. Oh, we are, we came through this way. It's just a different. It's just a different way to get to the same destination. Okay. Wait, is this taking me out? What the hell? That takes you in a circle. That's so weird. Well, so far, this is the most confusing tomb that we've encountered on our journey. Try this again. Where's the fourth? Right in front. Jeez. Well, that is bizarre. <laughs> that has to be a glitch because... <laughs> what the hell? Oh, that's kind of frustrating. Oh, well. What are you going to do? All of these places are built on ancient ruins. There it is. Chamber Judgment. Oh, a handgun part. That'll work. GPS cache map found. Oh, so there... That'll give us the location of the last one, I guess. Interesting. I wonder why it would be a separate... map. Oh! Unless I was... I don't know what happened there, but I'm pretty sure that I set things up the exact same way, but... Uh, something must have glitched or... That's really bizarre. I don't know. Must be the supernatural Yamatai. Sun Queen trying to mess with me.
This is the only thing that's left. There is a camp that I haven't, that I didn't activate, I think. I think I went past it and didn't set it off, but... Everything else is pretty much solid. We'll just grab the GPS cache. And then we'll be on our way. on the ground, so it's not going to be too terribly hard to find. down there. I guess... Okay, I, I see how we can get down there. Um... I don't know if that's a drop we want to make. Got it. Okay. It took a while, but it was worth it. Let's head to our main exit point here now. Somehow. We're probably going to have to make our way back across. I imagine now this is where we're going to ride one of those uh, crate setups that are roaming all over this place. Yeah, so we just got to figure out how to get on one now. This could work. Let's go. 